Hello everybody, this is Nanduram and we are from Sonu Academy. Today we are going to explain about cell division. Take a seed and break it open. There is no plant inside the seed. Similarly, if you break open an egg, there is no chick inside. But the seed when you sow in soil and water gives a plant which grows into a tree. Similarly, the heck when incubated which gives a chick. Have you ever thought how this is possible? Plants or animals make their beginning from a single cell called zygote. This single cell divides and produces two cells. They divide again and produces further cells. The four cells gives rise to eight cells. These cells are divided into several thousands of times to produce a plant or animal which has several thousands of cells. This process is called development and occur by cell division. These cells produced from the egg or zygote are two types of it. They are vegetables or stomatic cells and reproductive or germ cells. Various organs in the body are de derived from these two types of cells. For example, plants have stomatic and germ cells. In plants, stomatic cells produce roots, stem, leaf, etc. In plant, germ cells produce pollen mother cell, mesospore mother cell, etc. In animal, stomatic cells produce skin, bone, lung, kidney, brain, liver, etc. In animal, germ cells produce testis and ovary. As you can see, the germ cell gives rise to organs involved in the production of male and female gametes while the stomatic cell gives rise to almost the all organs except those producing male and female gametes. These cells that divided are called parental or mother cells and the resulting cell is the products of cell division or called daughter cells. All the stomatic cells divide by the process of mitosis while the germ cells divided by the process of meiosis or reduction division. The major difference between the mitosis and meiosis is the number of chromosomes in the daughter cell. In mitosis, the daughter cell have exactly the same number of chromosomes as the parental cell. In meiosis, the daughter cell have exactly the half number of chromosomes of the parental cell. Children, let us see the details about mitosis and meiosis and how they are given in the next two videos. Thank you. This is Nanduram and we are from Sonu Academy.